After we got some new clothes last week, we got a couple patches last week and some server maintenance. What is Rockstar doing this week to keep us in Red Dead Online for the new big update? Howdy Cowpoke, awesome BMX here and thanks for checking out today's weekly bonus and update video. Although we didn't get any update today, I was surely hoping for some kind of patch and uh, we got nothing, no no big update, no fixes of any kind at all today. We just got some, no, we didn't get any drip feed content as well. What did we get today? Oh yeah, we got some bonuses. That's right, some bonuses for the game that aren't really for me because they're mainly focused on new players. Hey, but let's get right into it, because hey, I, we want to play this game right, so let's go check it all out. Unfortunately, uh, this week's bonuses aren't really uh, that great. I was hoping they were going to be, and they're not. If we jump over to the newswire real quick, we have an emphasis on Bounty Hunters and Showdown modes today. Bounty Hunter and Showdown mode bonuses, plus discounts on Bounty Hunter Essentials and more. Okay, probably stuff that we already have. If we take a look at it, pretty cool pictures, though. This picture is pretty awesome. I think this might be a thumbnail, actually. It, it might be. I'm... I'm Record this video before I make a thumbnail or the next one too. We'll have to see how it works out. Get extra XP in bounty missions plus 50% XP boost in showdown mode. So this kind of is what we had last week. Last week we had a 40% XP boost on all role specific activities in the game, uh, including trader missions and resupplies and all bounty missions and selling stuff to Madame Nazar for collectible sets. Um, but there is something to take a look at down here. If we look at a little bit farther, it says, Vigilantes roaming the frontier looking for their latest score will be happy to hear that all bounty missions are and all 10 legendary bounties. That's pretty good. And bounty hunter freedom events. So that's great. Are doling out an extra 50% roll XP, 50% roll XP through February 24th. Come on. Seriously, Rockstar? All this stuff and you're getting 50% roll XP in Red Dead Online. Now, of course, 50% roll XP is fantastic for the game. I mean, if you're if you're looking to rank up your bounty hunter, this is a great week to do it. 50% uh, roll XP is fantastic. It'll get you ranked up twice as fast. Well, pretty close twice as fast. Maybe like a quarter fast because 50% of 100% is not really double, is it? But, hey, we won't do any math anymore on the, sh on the channel here. So, where's the bonuses and XP boost for standard players that are playing the game. I don't even need 50% roll XP, or did you unlock more tiers in the Bounty Hunter role that I don't know about that I, I need to rank up in? Oh no, I did those back in September. I did those back in September, Rockstar. So uh, I'm not sure what you're giving us here. I definitely didn't give me any incentive to get into the game and play. Now, they did give, I know why they did this, because they gave out the Bounty Hunter role for free two weeks ago. Right? Or was it even last week? No, it was definitely two weeks ago. It wasn't last week. They gave it out two weeks ago, the Bounty Hunter License, for free to anybody logging the game. All you had to do was log in the game and get the Bounty Hunter License for free. Now this week, they're allowing you to rank it up almost twice as fast with 50% roll XP boosts. Seriously. Come on now. That's ridiculous. Moving beyond that in the newswire here, we do have some stuff that, you know, high rank players or veteran players can get some bonuses on if you want to jump in and uh, play PvP and whatnot, which is pushing us into stuff that we don't really like to do anyway, but we'll probably jump in there and play a little bit. Those looking to measure themselves against their fellow gunslingers in any showdown mode, which I really am not, will also receive 50% XP boost all week long. Team up with a squad of hot-handed crack shots in this week's featured series Gun Rush Teams, which maybe we'll do that a few times on stream with uh, Posse. Blast your way through an ever-shrinking battle area littered with horses, weaponry, and armor to be the last team standing alive you can also pick up 50 percent boost xp in uh races this week as well so i'm not sure why this doesn't show up anywhere else in here uh, any highlighted stuff but uh, for showdown modes 50 percent boost in all showdown modes including races so that's pretty good if you guys enjoy that thing uh jump in there and get some of that stuff done now the newswire does go on to state some of the bonuses and benefits it does say if, you, if you're keeping an eye on your cash the wheeler ransom and coke catalog has assortment of deals on bounty hunter essentials Include a Bounty Hunter variant of the Schofield Revolver, as well as the Bolt Action Rifle. So if you haven't picked up those yet, that'd be a great way to get that. Uh, as well as 30% off the Lamat Revolver and the Repeating Shotgun. So again, some, some weapon upgrades if you don't already have those purchased. Remember that bringing your targets in alive boosts your earnings. Take 30% off the cost of the Reinforced Lasso. 
which anybody that's played the Bounty Hunter role for more than a week uh, probably already has the Reinforced Lasso. It probably was the very first thing you purchased in the Bounty Hunter role. If you didn't buy the Bounty Hunter license today and buy the, bounty, the Reinforced Lasso because you unlock that in the lower ranks before you even reach rank 5 in the novice rankings you unlock the ability to purchase that all you need to do I think is have one token and like 150 bucks so now you can get 30% off that if you haven't purchased it yet Rockstar come on don't don't pad your newswire with crap that no one was going to take advantage of let me know Rockstar next week how many people actually bought the reinforced last of this week I would seriously like to know thank you for that discount we we'll jump back into the game real quick. We're going to check out the Gunsmith because it does state that uh, there is a deals on Bounty Hunter Essentials, including the Bounty Hunter Variants and the Schofield and the Bolt Action. So I want to take a look at those real quick. I think the only place you can get those is from this guy here. Actually, I think I need to go to Customize to pick that up, not uh, here. I don't think I own the Schofield one on all my rifle or my both my Schofield, so I probably can take a look at that real quick and see if we can see how much that costs. Let's go down to our skull field real quick. Select that. Uh, Got to clean it because, of course, it's filthy. I haven't used this gun in a while. We're a Navy guy now. Yeah, so it does say it's on sale. It is 420. It's normally 600. So 600 to 420. So that is 180 bucks off. That is a 30%. So it is the same price as they say that the reinforced lasso is, and the Lamette revolver, and the repeating shotgun are. Um, so it looks like all that stuff is 30% off. So 30% off the variants for the skull field revolver, the bolt action rifle. The Lamat Revolver, the Repeating Shotgun, and the Reinforced Lasso are all 30% off this week. So that's not too bad if you haven't picked up any of those. I really do like this. If I actually used the Schofield, I probably would pick this up um, more. But uh, I'm in love with the Navy Revolvers right now. So we're sticking with those. And uh, we don't really need to spend any money with any of these discounts in the game this week. Also, make sure if you haven't used it already, the PlayStation Plus members will receive three Moonshine Mash refills and three Trader resupplies if you haven't done those yet. So make sure uh, you're working your Moonshiner and your Trader uh, rolls pretty good if you're on PlayStation so you can take advantage of those bonuses. If you've already received them and used them, I don't think you get them again. That was just like a one-time monthly thing. I think that is the February PlayStation Plus monthly giveaway. Um, they do say that Twitch Prime can still get the collector bag for free and the polished copper moonshine still for free. That's the current Twitch benefit. They haven't given us any more information on that, and they haven't given us any more information on any uh, updates coming in the game. I did mention in my video yesterday that I'm hoping they give us something, because I knew we weren't going to get anything great in the game today. We were just going to get a few bonuses here. I was hoping they are going to be a little better than these, but they're not. So, uh, Rockstar, you kind of dropped the ball, ball on that one. So, uh, that's not great at all for Rockstar. They did not mention in the newswire, but uh, I did mention it in yesterday's uh, Madame Nazar video, but we do have a new weekly set of course, today is Tuesday, it is the Herbas List Collection, it is, consists of three flowers, the Blood Flower, which can be found in the Bayou between 10 and 10 p.m. and 5 a.m., uh, we do have the Chocolate Daisy, which we went around and found a lot of those uh, this week with the Lovers Collection, so if you knew some of those spots, they're going to be there, and the Creek Plum, now unfortunately, there are a lot of Creek Plums in the game, um, these are really good for collecting for the Moonshiner roll as well, because they do make the, the Wild Creek Moonshine, so it's going to be hard selling those to make 60 bucks. Um, but you do get great XP for these as well. I think it's 1,000 XP without the boost this week that we got last week. So definitely make sure to watch our daily Red Dead Online videos for information every day on where these spots are available for you. If you want to get this set and sell it, you can sell it every single day for 60 bucks and 1,000 XP. Well, Cowpoke, if you like this video, make sure to smash the like button. If you're new around here, consider subscribing to the channel for more Red Dead Online content, including tips and tricks, news updates, gameplay, just good old-fashioned fun. Hope to see you on the prairie sometime, but until then, see you later.